G'day, this is Bruce and uh, welcome to my shop. It's been quite a while since I made a video. Um, what I've got here is 10, ten pieces that um, I'm machining by hand. So <clears throat> what I've done is from a bulk stock, uh, 1020 bar, um, I've machined, this was the first, um, first operation, was to machine this, to size here, this is for a bearing, um, and, and slice it off, and part it off, and then I've come to the second operation, which is basically to take this, put it in the lathe, and then do, um, do a centre, drill hole, tap, uh, and uh, chamfer and also machine this this facet <clears throat> ideal work for um, CNC ideal work for a, a turret lathe I don't have either so here we go we're going to bash away at this one I'll show you uh, the process um, we might be rough but we're, we'll get it done and these will be exactly to what we need Okay, so we go, there we go, we'll cut out all the noise afterwards. Right, the general machining, we're doing it at, uh, at 855 RPM, and the drilling and tapping, we're doing at 120 RPM. As I said, all manual. Um, the great part of the, uh, this is what we're using here, is a CNMG with a high rake. using two types of uh, fluids. We're using the, um, the fluid on board and also my um, uh, black smelly smoky thing. This I use for the centering and I use it also for the tapping. Everything else uh, is dry except for the, the drilling. I do the, the tap pre-drill then uh, I'll drill it to size for the tap. I've done the same thing with these these parts which I made yesterday also all hand done once again two operations did all one operation then did the other so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to face it off and then uh, cut through here to the uh, the size we need and then we're going to center it drill it tap it uh, and in between time we'll do a, a bit of a chamfer as well so off we go, there's lots of noise, I'll cut all the noise out from the, in the movie afterwards. And there, so there we go, we're off. A little bit of a pit here, not much. These are the lengths of them we've got, half a mil plus minus, so we're not much of them. What we need is to make sure that the diameter will be according to the spec, which I've written. Uh, now we're, just, we're going to go in five, between 5 and 6 mil depth. I'm going to cut that down to 30 mil. I'll go in just over five. Finish it off. And come back. And pick it up. And do that streak like a, like a 50 or 30. And we'll check it.
Yeah, we're fine. So we can now we now we'll just chamfer that. And normally I use the square, the square, but um, there's not enough clearance here. So instead of that, I'm using the, the like the triangular type of one. So uh, I just set that up just off the first center. In again, I'm going to cut that on the other side. I hate all these handles sticking out. Much prefer it like this with the multi fix to get it out of the way. Now we'll run, that, run up that uh, Cedrine to the black smelly smoky stuff. change speeds and the one gear to change from high to low Thanks for watching. Be told since I was eight or nine years old, we sailed away. I put and torn from home. Red dust seeps into my home. Lord, Lord, take me back. Later. Called the mines my own Face the threat I'm losing my sanity there Red dust 